Hi boys and girls, we're going to continue our conversation about transportation. Right now we're going to review what we've learned about a ship. How does a ship travel? Hmm, a ship floats on the water. Your turn. How does a ship travel? A ship floats on the water. Hmm, where can a ship be found? A ship can be found in the harbor. Where can a ship be found? A ship can be found in the harbor. We also talked about it can be found in the ocean or river or lakes. So it's on the water and those are all forms of water. Where and then right here, this one we talked about, a ship. Where can a ship be found? A ship can be found on the dock. Where can a ship be found? A ship can be found on the dock. Who uses the gangplank? Hmm, that's right. The passengers use the gangplank. All right, today, boys and girls, we're gonna talk about why this form of transportation is so important. There is, There are places that we wanna travel and there's no roads. And that is not, there's a few ways we can get there. And one of the ways we can get there is on the water. So what it can do is it can take passengers. So here's, we'll put our passengers right there. And we're gonna write passengers. Mm, we're gonna write it right here. P A S S. E N G E R passengers S. So we're gonna it'll take passengers and it can take oh look at that. Okay, so each one of these boxes would go on a truck, just one. And I'm going to show you a, the giant freight liner all together. So this is a freight liner. It's designed to hold these big, heavy boxes. Are you wondering what's inside? Hmm. I wonder if it's food. I wonder if it's clothes. I wonder if it's toys. Maybe all of those things. Okay, so freight or cargo. And I'm going to put that there. And then we're going to write... Cargo. C A R G O. So it is important, this form of transportation. Why is a ship important? It is important because it takes passengers and cargo on the water when they want to go from here to there. So there are times when we want to get across a place that has water. And so there are many types of ships or boats, and I wanted to show you some that are taking people. So this is a ferry, and you can see there's seats that are all lined up, but you can see the windows that show the water. And here is a similar ferry without the passengers in it, just so you could see what the seats look like and the windows. So there's lots of room for people to sit. If you're going on a ferry, normally it's not very, um, it's not very bouncy and um, a lot of times ferries are used if people are if there's a lot of people going back and forth to the same place all the time here's another ferry and I wonder if you've been on a ferry here's another ferry Here's that freight liner we were talking about and these are dock workers that are working right um, next to it and we're going to see some more places where they're going to be doing their job and here is a freight liner from the side so you could see it's all stacked up but it keeps going and going and going and going so it takes a lot of cargo from a place far away and it takes it all over the world because the world is connected by our oceans. Here's that freight liner empty. See, there's lots of room to stack everything all up. It's nice and flat. 
and this is a, a different kind, but the same kind of thing. The whole back part is all for freight. Here's some more dock workers. And so it looks like they're on kind of a lift. And here's the cranes that are gonna come take that freight, lift it up, move it over. And they're either gonna put it on a train they might stack it up to be sorted later, or it might go on um, a truck. But remember, on a truck, it just holds one. On a train, they can be too high, and then lots of cars are taking them. And then, of course, the freight liner holds even more. And I think that's it. I wanted to show you one more. I thought this was kind of interesting, but there are there are ships that you can drive on, ferries, and what happens is you drive out to here and this part goes down and then you drive on to the ship and it can take your car across the water, which is like freight. All right, boys and girls, that is all we have for today. I'll see you next time.